We're gonna try and tame that. No, seriously, that that's what we're doing. <laughs> Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Fjorder. Uh, and today, uh, we're gonna be trying to tame this Brachiosaurus. I know I didn't say that in my plans, but that's because I forgot about it. Um, which is my bad. Oh, boy. Well, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. I've, uh, I've done this before by myself, but honestly, not my cup of tea. <laughs> okay, so th this is an interesting tame to have to do. Uh, actually, while I'm thinking about it, I'm kind of a moron. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head back to base and acquire the proper tools for the job. Uh, very, very important that we do that. Well, basically, what I'm going back to get is I'm going to back going back to get my uh, crop plots and my crop plots. No, just my crops. Don't have any crop plots. Uh, just my crops that are in the fridge, and of course, uh, ooh, um, and of course, some biotoxin because we're going to need that. Now, the Brachiosaurus is uh, also from Ark Editions, I believe I've said that, uh, and it's um, actually one of the more interesting creatures in the mod. Uh, it's also one of the ones with quite an interesting taming method, much it, it, a little similar to the Acro in that it's a knockout tame, but not a typical knockout tame. For for the Brachiosaurus, as I as I've mentioned in the past, the way you tame it. Oh, hold on, let's actually fix that. Sorry. Sorry, I forgot to uh, put my pop filter in front of my microphone. That was really smart of me. Anyway. Um, that's the wrong drawer. Okay. Really? That's all the biotoxin I have left? Get out of here. Actually, that makes sense. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, no, we don't need it. Okay, why? This doesn't need to be in my hotbar. Uh, I also have, just in case we need it, we've got all of, all of that narcotic as well. So we should theoretically be just fine. Okay. Now, as I was saying... The way you tame a Brachiosaurus is by, um, is by shooting its hind legs when it has reared up to do its, uh, super stomp move. Which, you know, doesn't sound too hard, right? And, and in, in, pra in theory, it isn't. In practice, it isn't either, except for one problem. If he lands his super stomp, that is, I believe, a, almost a guaranteed kill. Like, you're not... Uh, it may not insta-kill your tames, but it almost certainly will instantly kill you. So... Yeah, bear that in mind going forward when you when you try and tame this. Oh! Oh, that almost hurt. Yeah. Andrew Sarkis does not take kindly to fall damage, so... Gotta be careful with that. Actually, if I find a lower level Bracky, there is something I'd like to try if I had the ammo to do it. Like, I'd attempt to use the turret to try to tame it. That'd be pretty fun. Like a, like a turret on an ascended saddle or something. That'd be pretty neat, right? Yeah, I'm totally going to do that at some point. We'll see. Okay, we're going to put all this in its inventory. Please do not eat my veggies. I believe Andrew Sarkis is supposed to be an omnivore in the game, although I, I don't know why it would be. Okay, we're going to put you on neutral. Okay, now, I, uh, I don't know how many, uh, how many, uh, shots this is going to take. But what I do know is that I have my, uh, is this time I am using the fabricated sniping ri sniper rifle. Uh, and just to be sure I have enough bullets, I brought 168 of them. If that's not enough, then I don't know what is. So I'm going to go up and I'm going to punch this guy in the toe. There you go. Have your... Ouch. Okay. 
Oh yeah, break my mask. Sure, why not? And what you want him to do... You, ow! Okay, well he's just breaking all my stuff. Fine. Really could have done it with a shield, maybe. Oh. Now on this tiny island, I'm realizing how dangerous this is. Oh! Okay. Okay. That hurts. Oh, he's quicker than I thought he was. Alright. Uh. Oh, there we go. Why is it doing that? It should be doing reduced damage, right? Am I, like, stupid? What's going on? Oh. Oh, no. Please be nice. We can be friends. We can be friends! Okay, gotta reload. Okay, there we go. That's what you want. Right there. Gotta be careful here. Oh. Gotta be careful because while he does have a lot of health. Oh, alright. He's uh, exited the stance. Alright, I'm gonna put on some armor while I'm thinking about it. Like actual armor. What the hell was that? Oh! Now, in real life, if an animal this size kicked me, oh, that wouldn't be an I'm almost dead. That would be a I am absolutely dead. I am a smear. I am a grass. I'm a stain on the grass. That's what I'd be right now. Oh. Yeah, no, I, I really need to find a better strategy. <laughs> Probably just shooting him with a bow would be enough. Yeah, I actually why did I why did I not think to do that? Come on. You know you Oh, okay. Well. You like your 6 damage? Now I Oh, oh, he's quicker than I Duh. Okay. This is a nerve-wracking tame. It wouldn't surprise me if I died. Like, I would not be surprised at all. The amount of damage the Bracky can do. Really? Fuck off. There we go. Ugh. <sighs> oh. Oh. Uh, I just have two. I have too low health to be cocky. No, no. Be smart. Basically, what you want to do, you want to try and kite behind him as best you can. But you also want to not get super close so that it provokes. Uh, oh. Okay. So I'm 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 gonna just be right be dead honest. I am by no means an expert with this taming method. I have done it before, but it's pretty it's it's pretty dicey when I've done it, so.
Really? That hit me? Okay, I want to take a look at his torpor, see what it's looking like. It's probably not looking too good right now. Oh, wow, it's literally zero. That doesn't make any sense. I wonder if shooting him and missing actually decreases it. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, that means we have to be extra careful. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy. Maybe you can't check its torpor. Oh. Nope. Come on. <sighs> okay. Well, the basic idea here, and I'm saying this in case I have to cut away, but the, the basic idea that we're trying to do is you want him to rear up, and when he does, you want to try and get behind him and shoot. Now, this guy is being very uncooperative. Okay, that was the worth that was a useless stomp. And unfortunately, as I said, I'm not a master at this. Oh, of course I get thirsty. Really? Come on. Ugh. Yeah, basically you're just trying to annoy it. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, oh boy. Come on. Really? Man. This is easier said than done, simply because this guy does not want to do his stomp as like his um uh mega stomp. Come on. Trying to like bit oh, god damn it. No, he he just straight up not interested. Now, see, if he had hit me right there, I'd be dead. Like, oh, this, this, this taming method makes me nervous. I really hope I don't have to do this a bunch of, like, I, man. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Damn it. That's irritating. Oh. Oh. God, this is... One of the more intense, uh, tames I've ever done in this game. Did he just de-aggro? No, he didn't. Yep, now he did. Damn it. Okay, can I check your torpor, please? Like, am I allowed to do that? I don't know if I'm allowed to do that. Uh... 
Uh, well, that's... Okay. This is gonna take a hot minute. I can already tell, and I'm no expert at this. So, odds are, I will be cutting away. I'm also calling some supreme bullshit on this taming method. This is... I don't know what it is. Well, not bullshit, but... I don't know. This just looks like it could be very frustrating. One of those ones where you could do everything right, and it doesn't matter. It's just gonna take a hot minute, and that's the end of that discussion. Stego! Get out of the way! Get, get, aww. Now, this is what I mean. Like, he keeps de aggroing, so his torpor is going down. It's like, really? Is it that hard to keep you upset at me, sir? Whoa! Ow. Thankfully, my armor is actually in good enough shape that it can tank him, so. <sighs> Do the thing. Come on. Do the thing. Mm. I'm not sure what I can do. If somebody has tips, please leave it in the comments to the more efficient way to handle this. Because this is... This is ridiculous. Like, I, I, I can't tell if it's me or the Bracky that's doing something, but I should be... I'm not saying it should be knocked out by now, but I am saying that it de-aggros so easily that it basically means, oh, you're losing all your torpor. Which I guess is part of the challenge. But that's the part I don't really care about or need to deal with. Oh, get out of here. Really? Alright, well, my gun broke, so I guess we're gonna do this again. God darn it. Alright, you know what? We're gonna cut away, and I will be back with some more ammo and a, and a repaired weapon. Ay, ay, ay. Alrighty, we are back properly. Uh, so I'm gonna attempt something, try a different idea with approach with this because this ain't working as is. Come on, really? Oh, Jesus, he hurts. Uh, so one quick update. We have switched back to the shoddy. I made some more ammo for it. Uh, hopefully this will work a little bit better. Won't be as accurate, though. And I'm using the Desmodus because I want to try and stay away. Oh, boy. We're going to go here. Oh, he, he's still mad at me. Ah, God, God, God. <laughs> Hopefully this works. I, I'd be, I'll be really upset if it doesn't, but... Uh, oh, okay. See, again, the problem you run into here is that, um... He keeps de off me, and it's really... It makes this a lot harder than it needs to be. Not only does it make the process take longer... It also is just a waste of time. Oh, I thought he did it for a second. Okay. Oh, come on. You know where I am. Oh, man. I did not want this to be so frustrating. Shit.
Really? Hungry again? Uh oh. See, the issue I have with the with being on a tame though is that I have a lot less control. So oh, god man. Ah you bastard. Wow. I missed trying to shoot the I missed again. <laughs> trying to shoot the bracky. Damn it. Uh Rain? Hmm. Wow, he just doesn't care. Oh! Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Desmoda should be very helpful with this team because I can actually do this at night. Come on, man. I don't have all day. <sighs> all right. I'm going to cut away again and... When this thing is, like, going into its knockout animation, that, that is when I will start recording. Like, I, I hope you get the basic idea from this. Like, the, the, what you want to do is, as I said, just shoot it until it, um, un shoot it on, in, like, below its knee, anywhere below its knee when it rears up to try and, uh, super stomp you. Oh, man. If I had known this was going to be uh, this much of a pain, I might not have done it this second. But oh well. Uh, should be well worth it. Hungry again. Jeez. Fucking bat fat. <laughs> Freaking fat ass. <laughs> anyway, I'll catch you guys later. I'll bring, I'll bring us back when it's about to fall over. Alrighty, welcome back one, once again. I, uh, I do apologize for how long that took and how salty I got about it. Uh, we had to go through a lot of... Oh! Whoa. Whoa. That was cool. Uh, it was also kind of creepy, but kind of cool. <clears throat> I had to go through a lot, of st a lot of bullets, as you can see, to finally get that thing down. Now, I think you can do it in far, far less... But, uh, for some reason, this guy just did not want to enter his, um, his, um, his rear up mode. So, I ended up, uh, I ended up going through a lot of ammunition before we finally brought him down. And it, and also, uh, shoddy is, is not overly accurate. Ugh. Ugh. But, in any event, I am pleased with the outcome. Oh, if you notice the durability on my shotgun, that is indeed because, yes, uh, I did have to go back to base and actually uh, restore it again, come back, and do this again. So, you know how it is. Just, uh... <laughs> Never can be too sure sometimes with this game. But, uh, this tame should be well worth the trouble. Uh, Brachiosaurs are fantastic from what I remember. The last time I tamed one was when I was on Aberration. And it has been a hot minute since I played me some Aberration. I really need to do that again. I've said it before and I'll say it again. If, uh, Arc 1 is still alive after I do an Elden Ring Let's Play, I will absolutely come back to play Aberration. 100%. Love Aberration. I have to make some more narcotic. Thankfully, I'm already cooking some up at the base. Also gonna have to get some, uh, more ammunition... Because, oh boy. <laughs> oh, man, all that metal. 
I don't even want to talk about it. Hmm. I like how, um, oh, come on. I like how the Bracky's head is clipping into the ground. It's like looking through the vastness of the time space out there. Are you eating? Okay, you are, just very slowly. I thought the, um... Did I use it? Hold on. Did I use the, uh, the thingy? I thought I did. Okay. What? What? I can look through his stomach and there's a window! <laughs> this makes no sense. Seriously, look at this poor, look at this poor man's ankles. How is he walking? How is he not, like, just at roar, like, moaning in pure agony on the ground? Oh, that's dark. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, boy. Wow, that's, that's gonna take a hot minute to tame him up. Um, thankfully, I have a lot, I think there's enough veggies in there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 110% there is. Only going up by 3%, but, uh. I'm going to be to retreat back to base. And, uh, yeah. I, I am sorry I didn't catch the, uh, sh the, him actually falling over. It's pretty funny. Um. He just totally topples. And in real life, if a Brachiosaurus fell like that, it most likely wouldn't kill them, actually. It's like, oh, they'll fall and die. I mean, if they fall off of a ledge onto another ledge, they will. Yeah, sure. Like, if they fall from a distance. But if they just fall over, yeah, it's gonna hurt, but probably not gonna be fatal to them. Why is this on? <sighs> okay, we need more gunpowder. Okay, I need to do another Narcoberry run. Noted. But yeah, no, I, I wanted to tame another Arcadition's creature, and I remember finding that Bracky before, so. Uh, all right, very much within the budget to make that. Probably a Smithy-only saddle, though. To quote some owl somewhere in some commercial, let's find out. I wonder what happens if I eat that. Do I turn into a vampire? That'd be awesome if I if that as if somebody somebody make a mod where if you do that, if you drink that, it transforms you into an actual vampire. Which would do absolutely nothing, but it'd be kind of cool. Okay, here we go. We're making the bracky saddle. Um, I do have to keep an eye on that Brachiosaurus because, uh, man, everything just started making noise. Um, I do have to keep an eye on that Brachiosaurus because its torpor does go down pretty fast. But taming that Brachy is a big step, um, both figuratively and very literally. Uh, you cannot put a platform saddle on the Brachiosaurus, which I'm absolutely fine with. 110% I'm okay with that. Um, doesn't really need one. I never really liked the idea of platform saddles aside from the memes. But... Okay, you have it full. Oh, boy. Well, this is going to take a hot minute. Alright, here's what we're going to do. I will bring us back when this finishes. So I thought I'd bring us back just for a brief moment because uh, we're at 69% taming effectiveness. Am I being absolutely immature right now? Oh yes. Do I care? Nope. 
all I'm here to do is say, all I'm here to do right now is say, hey, <laughs> nice. Anyway, moving on. Bring it back when it's fully tamed up. Okay, and in a few moments, the Brachiosaurus should be fully tamed up. Uh, as you can see, we're at 98.3%, and I've spent the last, um, longer than I would care to admit, let's just say that, sitting here on this rock, on this rock with Kamazots, just waiting while listening to the Star Wars Cantina music on a 10-hour loop. No, this did not take 10 hours, thankfully. <laughs> but, <laughs> I mean... It still took longer than most of my other tames, and that's on my improved settings, so. <clears throat> hey, let's go. Oh, wow, I was out of range to name him. That's pretty funny. Anyway, all right, let's get some name suggestions in the, in the comments, and if you uh, like the footage and you want to see more. Okay, is audio working as intended here? Looks a little quiet. There we go. Alright. The fuck? What's that? Hmm. Oh! Okay, so I forgot to mention something. Uh, Brachiosaurus drops Torpor really fast. So, uh, if you're not careful... Um... Actually, well, I'm gonna try something. Nah, I tried to land on the side of him. He can't do that. Darn it. All right, well. Okay. But if you like the content and you want to see more, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. It, uh, it's a big help. In any event, I have uh, things to do and places to... Holy moly. All right, okay. Turn that down a notch. I've got things to do and places to go, so let's get this demonstration out of the way. But first, first, it's uh, it's thumbnail time on this big boy. I'm snapping screenshots, don't mind me. All right, I think we got enough. Uh, we got enough thumbnails for that. Just look at the sheer size of this thing. Again, larger than the real Bracky ever was, but still an impressive species, to, an impressive specimen to be sure. English words hard. An impressive specimen to be sure. Uh, capable of gathering a great many things. Holy sh! Uh, it, oh. That health, though. Oh, oh, you know we have to do it. All right, so that C gives us into um, hind leg stance and left click. Bye, Stego. <laughs> Deleted. Just, just straight up deceased. Okay. Now, Brachiosaurus is not a fast animal. But it, as you can see, it is capable of gathering uh, flint and stone. Wood, just as well. What's right click do? Right click is the back kick. Okay, control is, if I'm not mistaken, that is a fear roar effect. I also want to point out that my saddle, my seat is right on top of its head. Which actually makes a lot of sense, so I can just grab the reins real easily. Now, in real life, Brachiosaurus was a very tall boy, but not this tall and not this big. This guy is taller than this in-game Titanosaurus, and that's uh, absolutely preposterous. No sauropod. I don't think any sauropod approached that size, but... 
Oh, well, there's a little issue there. Can't do this on terrain, I don't... Or, like... Yeah, no, you can't. Um... Yeah, but what you're seeing right here, this is why I said the Brachiosaurus is well worth the trouble needed, trouble to tame it. Like, 100%. Because of the sheer versatility you get out of it. You can, I think you can ha you can gather almost everything in the game. Uh. See that? Yeah, look at that. Although it not doesn't gather as, as well as some creatures do. If Brachiosaurus is meant to be a, a oh, meant to be a tank, like a tank and a damage dealer with that uh, super stomp. Oh, see this, this right here, this is me running. Oh, 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 where are you going, buddy? No, no, it's my. Oh, oh, please don't friendly fire Kamazots. I'll be so sad. What? I still do pretty respectable damage. Just gonna stomp the meat into pulp right there. Okay, there's one thing I have to try before we end this episode. God, look at the model on this, by the way. Look at how well this, look how great this model looks. I love how it's uh, gathering berries animation. Is it kicking its foot backward like it's a cat in the litter box or something? <laughs> Sir, you are in my way. Therefore, you die. Therefore, you must die. Wait, what? What? Aw. Oh, it. Wait, what? I didn't know you could gather meat, but what did I gather it from? Okay, gotta wait a little bit before I can try this again. I did not do a damage, I glitched or something. He's going in the water. That fear roar effect, by the way, if I'm not mistaken, is more powerful than the, uh, than the, um, you Tyrannus, in that it just lasts longer. Let's try this again. Oh! Oh! Oh, look at the damage! <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> oh, yes! This is gonna be amazing! <laughs> oh, fantastic! Alright! And on that, uh... Oh my god, they're bent in every angle. Alright, and on that note, I think we're gonna call it an episode... This'll be TBT, signing off.